In the last video, we have seen how to make XOR gate using NAND gate and this is the circuit and I explained all the thing and how we can get this circuit link in the description below. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make XNOR gate using NAND gate. As we know this output is XOR gate, so we have to add one NOT gate using NAND gate and its output will be x naught. So this is how we can get x naught output using NAND gate. We'll connect the LED in this. This is connected to here. This is disconnected. This is connected to the input of this NAND gate and then it is connected to the LED. Now as we know IC 7400 has 4 NAND gate but here we need 5 NAND gate so we will use 2 pieces of 7400 and here it is its pin diagram and we will use the first NAND gate and its input is 1 and 2 and the output is pin number 3 so from the pin number 3 we will get the XNOR output and the XNOR output will be its truth table is when both the input is equal or same the output is 1 if not same then the output is 0 and if again the output is same so we will get 1 in the output and we will verify this in the practical in the last video we have seen till this now we need another NAND gate IC 7400 this IC 7400 pin number 7 is connected to the ground pin number 14 is connected to the positive rail pin number 1 and 2 are connected pin number 11 of first NAND gate is connected to pin number 1 and 2 to the second NAND gate so here it is pin number 11 and it is connected to here pin number 1 or pin number 2 then the output that is pin number 3 is connected to the LED. Now I am connecting plus 5 volt power supply. Here it is negative and the positive. As both the input is 0 0 so we are getting 1 in the output. Same input means we will get the output. Now 0 1 output is 0 1 0 output is 0 and if both the input is 1 1 then we will get the output. So this is how we can make X naught gate using NAND gate. So guys this is all for today. Thanks for watching.